What is up YouTube and welcome to this Flash Season 3 video. So, Savitar is huge, huge. He is future Barry, so don't trust yourself or don't trust anyone, especially yourself. Those memes are flying about and they are hilarious. So, if you're new to the channel, please do click that subscribe. Please do click that like and click that bell button next to the subscribe button so you get those notifications and you never miss a video so welcome people to this video and it is something which i'm very interested about it's something that someone raised on my live stream on saturday and it is a very very good question i think personally but it is very important especially if my theory that this is this barry is a future timeline of himself. So what the hell is going on? So Savitar is Barry. A lot of people are saying that Savitar could actually be someone else. There could be an original Savitar, which is something I'm probably going to do a video on at some point on this channel. And it's, again, another very good question, which I think is a question which needs to be asked and hopefully answered because obviously there is someone else in the comics but timelines are interesting time again itself is very interesting of course because well the flash has different time rules to legends of tomorrow which is really really weird and the most notable thing in my opinion is that at the end of the reverse flash storyline we actually had a very huge sacrifice, which was Eddie, the original Bay of Iris. And I can't help but think that Barry was sitting there thinking, oh yeah, he's going to kill himself and then I'm going to get Iris. He wins on both accounts there, doesn't he? But the question is, and it was answered there, is that well, we have the grandfather theory, which is if you die, if your past self dies, or if you go to the past, if you meddle around with it and your past self dies, you will die as well, which is a huge thing. I mean, we saw this featured in Back to the Future. And of course, obviously, Eddie killed himself and then Eobard Thorn ceased to exist, but then came back in the underwhelming Flashpoint story, which I didn't think they went as far as they could have actually gone with it, to be honest. They could have done it for half of a season but you know what they're doing what they're doing and it's been a decent season so far but the question is well iris is seemingly going to die obviously we saw that huge cliffhanger mid-season so what is barry actually going to do he's been trying to he's gone to the future to try and fix it he now has tracy brand helping him out and he's thinking of all these different ways to actually fix and save Iris. But really, after the huge reveal, there's only one thing which he could actually do. And that is give his own life to stop Savitar himself. So in the upcoming promo for this week's episode, we see them try and stop memories from being created and all this business. But what if... He actually killed himself and, well, his future self would cease to exist and, well, he, Savita, or Iris would survive. None of this would have actually happened and that's it. End of the show. But Barry is the show. Barry is the Flash. He, Barry is the whole entire damn thing. And you're not going to kill off someone like Grant Gustin the head of the show the the main star i mean his name is the the show so i really don't think they're actually going to do this even though it is on the surface it is the most obvious thing that they could actually do to stop savitar he could pull an eddie kill himself just at star labs he's like oh here's a gun kurt cobain done and he is gone he is finito and savitar then does the whole thing where he's looking at a picture of himself and he's slowly disappearing as all those memories slowly end. Now, obviously, this is a huge, complex 
thing. Obviously, time on these shows is completely different. It doesn't set. It is like wet cement, as we saw on Legends of Tomorrow. But I'm not really sure we can really take Legends of Tomorrow's time rules for granted or take it as fact on this show because they're so completely different on The Flash. But Andrew Kreisberg has said that that future thing, the future message, is going to be raised and recognised on the show, which would kind of work. Now, the problem is, this whole Barry being killed, or killing himself to stop him future self, is, well, people are thinking that it could be a time remnant, and well, if it's a time remnant, maybe he has to go back in time, stop the time remnant from being created, and then that is it. Because if it is someone else, that person's outside of time. If he kills himself right now, currently in the timeline, after in a chronological order of this season, well, that person's not going to die because that isn't the future self, if you're with me. I know it's getting a bit complicated, but I think that he could kill Savitar, he could kill his future self if he kills himself, but that is all dependent upon him being an actual future self. And in my theory, I do think that this was a linear timeline and then Flashpoint messed it up, gave him a chance to get out of this prison because, well, when he changed that in the past, it changed the future. But there is a flaw in that theory. There is a Thor a flaw, not a Thor, that's Marvel. There is a flaw in all of these theories, to be honest. But I think I'm probably going to do a video next on is there an original Savitar, which there could be. There could actually be. He could have taken inspiration from one of his greatest villains. But let me know what you think in the comments. Please you drop a like. Please you subscribe. And I'll see you soon. Goodbye.